T, can you hear me? The team with the most correct answers wins the challenge. Number one. Let's start off with something easy. Chicken. <sighs> Texture. Taste. Turkey. Uh, wrong. Chicken. Chicken. Well done. Next one. Pears? Uh, oh, man. Wrong. Apple. Apple. Ooh. Correct. Megan, you are staying dry. Oof. <laughs> How are you feeling, Michelle? Get too right. <laughs> this water is really fucking cold. My toes are cold, my feet are cold. I do not want to get dunked in water today. I just did my hair. Come on, T, you can do this. Next one. Count. Carrots. Huh. Carrot. Last one. Cauliflower. Mmm. Cauliflower. Yes. Yay, I don't have to go in the water. Good job, T. Can I get down now, please? Cauliflower. Well done, Millie. Yeah, four for know. four. You have a palate, young man. Thank you, sir. Oh, okay, yeah, four for four. Boom, here y'all go. Perfect. I could be Helen Keller in a blind taste test. OK, Alison and Randy, take your place in the dunk tank. Joshua and Nick, let's go. Let's go, sure. Excuse me, ladies. I'm very confident in my palate. I mean, I've been eating things since I could walk. Lobster. Come on, guys. You work with it every day. Mmm. Lobster, chef. Crab meat. <sighs> Easy one. Celery. Celery, chef. Great job. Alison, you are dry, young lady. Turnip. Here we go. Uh, Randy, get ready, bud. One more wrong, and you're dunked. Spinach. <laughs> Parsley, chef. Close. Randy's going to get this? Not looking very good, is it, chef? Lettuce. Bye-bye, Randy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Randy, get out. <laughs> American cheese. Come on, Nick, you've got to get one right. As a former fat kid, you know, every sandwich I had had American cheese. <laughs> so I knew it right away. American cheese, chef. Well done. Three or four. American cheese. Oh. Sorry, Randy. Josh has delivered a strong performance for his new team. Uh, Josh, well done. Thank you, chef. And the score is now tied. Walking in like 10 seconds with this risotto. Why did you tell me? I I'm keep I'm it up. screaming and I'm walking with it Stop. for like a minute. Let's go. Coming right lobster. now, chef. The lobster tail should have been done. Walking with risotto. Where's the, where's the lobster? Coming right now, chef. Lobster, drop a lobster, Joy. Stop right there. Did you just say drop the lobster? Yes, I did, chef. Come here, you two. You, come here. The lobster is not even in. How long is it going to take you to cook that lobster tail? 45 seconds, chef. Really? Yes. Do you know what? Get me lobster cooked in 45 seconds. Your time starts now. Good luck. Best wishes. 15 seconds gone. The pressure's on. Come on. 30 seconds gone. Like, oh my gosh, cook faster. 40 seconds gone. Time. Here we go. Cold, touch in the middle. Cold and raw. Oops. Jeff, I did not hear. You didn't hear. Photo. The communication is fucked communication. up. Communication, yeah, it's really not... fucked up. Well, let me communicate something really clear to you. You, 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 fuck off upstairs. I'm done. Fine. Get out. Frank and Ashley, up we yeah, go, Frankie. please. Come on, Frankie boy. OK, 
Ashley, describe yours, please. I have for you a ground beef slider with aioli made of caramelized onion, mayo, ketchup, and pickle relish. As I'm looking at Ashley's dish, I'm thinking that it looked like a regular burger to me. There's no way she's winning this one. I got it. Frank, describe yours. What I did was I got some pancetta and rendered it down until crispy, just for another texture and to enhance the flavor of the burger and a little bit of liquid smoke. Liquid smoke? Yes, just, just okay. a drug. I didn't ask you to get crazy. I just want you to cook what was on your back. Do the recipe. Frank, I want to grab you by the neck and just shake you. The recipe is the recipe, and you can't deviate from it. Here's the thing. Had you followed the recipe, that would have been a near-perfect burger. Ashley, congratulations. Thank One you, point Chef. to the red team. Good job. Good job. She only won because I lost. That's not a winner. That's, that's not a winner. Eddie, Amanda, let's go. Wow. Right, uh, Amanda, describe the dish, please. Um, I made a ground beef burrito. It's seasoned beautifully, but it is not a burrito. It's taquito. Ah, uh, fuck me, man. Danny did not tell me it was fucking taquito. Eddie has not only made the right dish. You've got the right kind of heat in there. Point for booty. He has done it correctly. Yes. Next up are Mies and Alan, who both made fish sandwiches. Visually, they look great. Beautiful, glistening, moist. Alan, fish could do with a bit more color. Point to the ladies. Good job. Well done. Good job. With the score tied once again. Vanessa, Kevin, let's go. It's time for the battle of the cheesesteaks. Are you allergic to salt? No, I'm not sure. It's so bland, it's extraordinary. Who tasted your dish? Uh, it was me, Chef. Good job. Point yes. to the blue team. Up next, spaghetti carbonara, prepared by Ariel for the women. Tasty, really tasty. And Jared for the men. Spaghetti's cooked perfectly. Thank you, Chef. You know, they're on point, and you follow the recipe exact. You've both got a point. Great job. Well done. What do you think? Joe, Jackie, let's go. Now, with her eggplant parmesan. Wow. Jackie must win this round to keep the women's chances alive. Man, they look different. Joe, describe your dish. Uh, it's a rustic uh, eggplant parmesan. It's some chiffonade basil. It's garnish. It's crunchy. It's delicious. Thank you, chef. Jackie, what's the secret behind a, a good baked eggplant? It's got to go where? In the oven. I put it in the pizza oven. Don't even worry about it. I got this. I got this. Just visually here, you can see that, you know, it's nowhere near cooked, yeah? And it looks terrible. Yeah. Big point to the blue team. Congratulations. Blue team wins. Yeah! Yeah! yeah. Hell yeah! There we go! Yeah. There we go! Yeah. There we go! Yeah. There we go! Yeah. Uh, Jackie, you forgot your diapers. Already. Right. Randy and Megan face off in the battle of the burger. With Randy hoping that his cheese and chili stuffed burger. Did you want to cook well done? I would have liked it about a medium rare of chef. Will top Megan's burger made of spicy lamb. All flavors I love, really tasty. Thank you. It's almost a gyro on a hamburger yeah. bun. Um, David, is it red or blue? Wow. I promise I'm not just copying David. <laughs> <laughs> I know that my dish was good. I'd eat the shit out of it. Battle of the mac and cheese, please. Let's go. I'm feeling like pretty good about my mac and cheese. Let's hope for the best. Alison. Yes, Chef. I've never seen mac and cheese in a bun. I just wanted to do something a little bit different. Different is good, but mm -hmm. just being different for the sake of being different is not a good enough reason. Yes, Chef. Mm. How's that, David? Uh, Taste-wise, it's a little too crunchy. Yeah. Joshua, please explain. I have a uh, three-cheese bechamel, elbow uh, macaroni, and artichoke hearts. That's delicious. I like everything that's in that. Thank you, Chef. Uh, let's begin with Suzanne, please. I'm going to go with blue. Woo! Thank you, Chef. Very good. David, please. Yeah. I knew that that dish did not look great. It was kind of like confirmation that I wasn't nuts. Time for the battle of the spaghetti. Let's go, please. With the men up by two in the final round, Brendan is looking to clinch a victory for his team and avoid a third straight challenge loss. This is a play on traditional spaghetti carbonara. It has shiitake mushrooms, shrimp, finished with a fried egg on top. Pretty well balanced. 
I'd be happy if I went to a fine dining restaurant and got something that looked like them. Yeah. It's good. Sarah, please describe your dish. Um, it's a little bit of Parmesan, some fried kale on the bottom, some prosciutto that I fried as well, some cherry tomatoes, shiitake mushrooms, zucchini, and then the egg. Too much, too much, too much. Oh, and lobster as well. It's got more ingredients than a puttanesca. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> It was actually really delicious. And I was afraid at each ingredient you could put, like, make her stop saying ingredients, please. I really liked it. Thank you, chef. Thank you. Thank you, chef. Suzanne, David, is it red or blue? You guys make it tough. But I have to go with the. Wow. Um, good. David. Wow. We have to break the tie. So I'd like to see Sarah's dish, Megan's dish, Brett's dish, and Joshua. You got it, brother. Thank you. I'm confident. I knew I had a, a great macaroni and cheese. Back in line, please. Thank you. So the best dish out of these four will win the challenge overall for their team. Across the board, the season was incredible. Yes, amazing. I'm between the two of them, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You happy with that decision? Yes. Well, there is an overall winner. Congratulations. Sarah, the red team, well done. What? I came out here to fucking lose. I'm fucking furious.